Welcome back everyone to a brand new Fortnite video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the brand new creative box in creative mode. And where you can get them out of, how to use them, what, how to make songs and beats and stuff like that. But yeah, without further ado, let's hop right into the video. If you haven't already, make sure you use my supporter creator code, just go to the item shop support creator. That is my code, and if you haven't already, make sure to drop a sub. We do videos and streams every day on Fortnite. But with that all out of the way, um, first thing you're going to want to do is obviously go to creative mode. I would recommend doing it this way by going to select game mode first. If you're on mobile, then you can just do it the standard way. But by doing this, it'll make you lag a little bit less, in my opinion. So you just go to creative mode, and then you're just going to obviously want to start your own creative island. Go all the way to the right, start a server, and bam. And that's the pretty straightforward part, and now I'm going to let it load, and I'll show you guys what to do from there. Alrighty guys, so once you have loaded into your island, you're obviously just going to go to the Golden Rift. This is the pretty straightforward part, very, very simple. So yeah, you're just going to want to go here, and then you'll load into your island. I'm just going to get out of here, because this is my island. And I'll go to a more open space to show you guys, and give you guys a better picture. So let's say I wanted to build my um, thing over here. Just say, for example, you go over here, and I'd recommend building like a floor place or a tunnel area where you can actually build. So let's go ahead and do that now. You're going to want to get a prefab. And you're just going to want to copy one of these kind of prefabs or like the advanced stuff. Copy this and then you're going to make your tunnel way. I think you should make it um, too high. I mean too wide. So just do that. Copy it all the way down. This will just make it a little easier to place your blocks. Um, and then from here, just make it too high as well. So just do here. And then also, if you want, you can also place a roof, which will do. Um, and then once you've done that, copy um, one of the floor pieces. Go up top. And then put your roofs real fast. Let me just put these real quick. Alrighty guys, so once you have your pathway, you're just going to edit um, a little bit outside. And then you're going to go to inventory, and then you're going to go to prefabs. And if you scroll down, just go very slowly. You'll slowly, if you go slowly, you'll see this thing right here. This is the prefab you want. So just click on it, make sure it's like outlined, and then you're going to click equip. Then in one of your slots, you're going to have this. You're just going to want to throw that down. And then it'll give you all the music blocks. From here, you can go ahead and see every single music that you want. So, for example, you just stand on it or hit it. It'll show you every single music. So, there's a piano. We got the piano. And then we got whatever this is. We got this. And then when you go up, it's just going to be higher or lower pitch. Then you got this one. And then you finally got this clap sound. So, yeah, if you want to actually make these. Oh, why is somebody joining my server? You're just going to pretty much go here, copy one of these, and then you're going to um, go like that, and then like that, and then now you'll be able to, hold up, let me, why is this guy on my server? Alright, so we did leave, thanks to um, Nicky Rompo for actually leaving, next time I'll make my party private, didn't realize that, but thanks for leaving, man. Um, yeah, as you can see here, whenever you walk over now, if you just walk in a straight line, it'll actually play, you don't have to step on both of them, so for example like this. If you just go in the middle of them both, it'll actually play. If you don't step on them, just go in the middle of them. And then, yeah. So then you can, like, get your baseline. So I'd say just get, like, a yellow one. You can choose whichever pitches you want. Just place them here. You can also place it over here if you just rotate it. So if you do, um, which is it, pull. Wait, what's this do, actually? Push. You can do push and then pull. That'll just make it go up and down. If you do rotate, it'll just rotate it like this if you want to make it look nice. And then if you do collision, it'll just make it go like that. Um, but yeah, you can actually just make it look however you want. But yeah, then you just place them here, and then um, we'll test it out. See, so yeah, as you can see, that's pretty much how you use them. Now I'm going to make a beat real fast, and I'll show you guys how it turned out. Alrighty guys, so here we do our um, little bass line, and then we're going to add some melody and stuff like that. I'm not going to be making a huge, huge uh, musical thing, but um, I forgot to make it in there because I'm an idiot. But um, just to show up for you guys, um, that just makes it look nicer. It still works if you're in the open. But yeah, this is my bass line, and then we'll add like the rest. Yeah, it's alright. I mean, it's just a tutorial. Um, I'd recommend like doing a little bit of a better bass line, but um, yeah. Now let's go ahead and select our melody, so I'm um, going to see what music I want. This one just sounds really ugly. 
I, and that's just a piano. So I'm gonna go with this one right here. So um yeah, I'll be back with you guys once we've finished. Alrighty guys, right here we do have the finished product. Just make sure when you're actually doing this, the pieces aren't actually touching because if not, you're gonna have to actually step on both of them at the same time, which will be a little difficult if you don't have two players. Right here, I didn't fully do it because this isn't like an actual big thing that I'm trying to do. It's just a tutorial. But um, yeah, let me just show you guys the finished product. You can use any of these that you want to make a cool beat. But um, yeah, with all that out of the way, let's go ahead and check this out. Yeah, not really, not really a song, dude. But um, yeah, that's just to give you guys an idea. Now, there's people all, all in my um, cater server. I should have thought of making this right before. They're not leaving. But um, yeah, that's going for the video there, guys. If you have any questions on how to make these blocks, just make sure leaving them down below. If you guys want me to actually work on like a cool song, let me know as well. I'll try to make one if you guys want. Like what you guys want to make, like what you guys want me to do about. But um, yeah, what you guys want me to do the um, music blocks about. But um, yeah, I'll make sure to update you guys if anything new does change with these blocks. But yeah, that's gonna wrap up the video there, guys. Hopefully, this did help you guys out. I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace. Thank you.